Oh, I'm sorry, Salmon. My bad. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Alex Farnham, and you're watching Animalist News. Marijuana, weed, pot, whatever you may call it, the fact is, is that it's killing the salmon. That's right, Northern California's salmon population is in decline because of marijuana growing operations. Whoa. In order to sustain the estimated 4,000 marijuana farms in Northern California, water is being drained out of the Eel River. This particular river used to be home to nearly half a million Chinook salmon, but with farmers using up the six gallons of water per pot plant a day, their presence is becoming scarce. So to give you guys some perspective, some professional marijuana farms can have up to 20,000 plants. That's a lot of water. But not only is the salmon's environment drying up, it's also being polluted due to pesticide and fertilizer runoff. Salmon are some of the most vulnerable fish in the world because of their specific habitat needs. In order for their younglings to survive, salmon must lay their eggs in completely clean, fresh water. So, when pesticides enter the ecosystem, they make the river completely uninhabitable for the eggs. In simpler terms, no salmon eggs equals no adult salmon. In fact, the Eel River has become so polluted and shallow that scientists aren't expecting salmon to return next year at all. This entire situation has been made even worse by the fact that this is California's driest year ever, but most people are blaming the marijuana industry for the salmon's decline. Do you think we'll see similar environmental trends in other states that have legalized marijuana? Let me know in the comments below. In other news, Animalist has added another show to its family. Check out Ferocious with Mike Falzone. Hey there, it's your buddy Mike Falzone. Do you like animals and also couples having disagreements in public? We can't get a pet bunny, jeez! Inbred, junky, carnivorous, bloodthirsty. They throw poop. What did I say? Well, looks like it's gonna be a pretty awesome show, so you guys should head over there and subscribe. That's it for today's episode of Animalist News. You can check out other episodes over here, subscribe, and until next time, I'll see you hairy mammals later.